Hello everyone, it's Nikki here. I wanted to just have a quick chat with you about a couple of things. One, we're doing our workshop on Thursday, Trailblazing Creatives, for those of you who are in London, and we still have a couple of places, but we're also doing an online course now for anyone international who wants to have an experience of what it means to be a Trailblazing Creative. Um, and I also wanted to reflect a little bit about the webinar we did the other day. Some of you won't have been there and haven't had an access to the replay and I just wanted to reflect on some of the things that we talked about and what what we're learning about this process so we talked very much about marketing for creatives creative people often don't enjoy marketing themselves often find the self-promotion side really tricky and our our mission Mine and Bev's mission is to make it more joyful, to make it more in alignment with your values because what we talked about on the webinar was how much people resist marketing because it feels it feels pushy, it feels self-conscious, we feel like people are gonna judge us. And the key point I made was if you're not able to come to terms and learn to be good and learn to enjoy marketing, then you're putting a barrier in front of your biggest potential in life. You have the potential to go bigger, to reach a wider audience, to make a difference to people's lives if you can learn how to overcome some of those self-limiting blocks that get in the way of marketing. Um, and so one of the key points we made was reframing marketing in a way that aligns more with your values. So some of the things we talked about is going from instead of something I have to do but hate it, to embracing it and thinking actually this is part of my creative evolution. It's about me expressing myself fully. It's about me being a, a thought leader to inspire people. It's about having a purposeful life. If you're marketing well, what you're doing is you're expressing your opinions, your thoughts, you're influencing people. And that's so much uh, part of what we teach on our course, Troubles and Creatives. We believe it's an inner game. It's an inner game to get good at marketing. It's, it's really about telling the world that you have something to offer. And so it's an inner game of overcoming some of the barriers that get in the way of you expressing yourself and learn, learning how to do it in a compelling and inspirational way. So I hope you find that interesting and I hope if you're in London, you want to come and join us. And if you're not in London, you no longer have that barrier because we are launching an online program. So you'll find all the details underneath this blog. Let us know what you think about marketing and I'd love to know how you can reframe it in a way that makes you feel more inclined to want to do it. Okay, that's all from me. I'll speak to you soon. Bye.